Dawn has arrived in South Georgia and somewhere down there is Iceberg A68A, except now it's got a whole bunch of brothers and sister bergs, A68D and various others. Anyway, let's see, let's actually see this berg. Since the last video, a lot has happened. For starters, the British Air Force have actually flown over the berg and got a bunch of pictures of it prior to the recent breakup. As the iceberg approached South Georgia, as we were kind of expecting, it has moved with the current and shifted down towards the south around South Georgia, but it has not escaped unscathed and has touched the shelf and as a result has broken off these pieces. The problem that A68A has is that it has freeboard heights, which are the height above sea level of about 30 to 40 meters, and that implies a depth below the sea surface of about 200 meters below sea level, whereby the ice extends. And the problem is that South Georgia is surrounded by a shelf that is around that depth, and so consequently it has been scraping and grinding and hitting with some force on the shelf leading to these breakups. But it's also thrown off a ton of icebergs and a lot of them have grounded on the shelf. Some of them you'll notice are not actually moving between these two images which are three days apart. And that is an indication that these ones are stranded on the shelf because they are so thick as well, like the massive iceberg itself. So now if we take a look at the Sentinel-1 image, we've got South Georgia up here and now after a collision with the, the shelf, well, first of all, look at all of these bergs that have come off and are lingering over the shelf. But anyway, we've got A68D, which is up here, and then A68A is down here. And down here, I believe this is A68F and E. Let me just check and confirm that. But regardless, it has broken up. And I wonder whether there has been another collision with some undersea seamount here. And beyond that, well, then we're going to get the iceberg presumably going to circulate around South Georgia and perhaps ground over here, where it looks like there are a bunch of icebergs probably from earlier that have grounded or are patrolling this area and that is gonna be about it from me please leave a comment and say hello and happy christmas to you by the way